So the next movie review is from 2001. That beyond. Atlantis, The Lost Empire. Came out in 2001. This star Michael J. Fox. Yeah. Uh, yeah. This is the DVD of it. We're good. Surely. <clears throat> So this movie stars, um, oh yeah, let me, let me type it, uh, Atlantis, no, not the, Atlantis, The Lost Empire. It's released in the summer of 2001. The stars, um, Michael J. Fox, James Garner, James Garner, Craig Summer, Don Novell, Bill Morris, Claudia, Claudia, Kristen, Joe. Jaqua, feeling out breaker. Um, Flora Stanley, David Ogan Steers, John Mahoney, Jim Farney, Corny Burton, and Leonard Lemon. It directed by, so the movie is directed by Gary Trustdale and Kurt Wise. Yeah. The budget is ninety million dollar to one twenty million. Box office one hundred eighty six one point one million dollars. Um. So yeah. Yeah. It started with my uh, with Milo. Uh, Michael Jake Fox plays um. As Milo, Tatch, yeah. So, yeah. So he goes to um the guy who uh, goes on uh, run away, but um, but a guy named uh, I forgot his name. He want he tells them to go find their found Atlantis do exist. Yeah, I think when he gets there, he got we got recruited with new crewmates. Um. Yeah. So him and his crew. Um, what is their the crew's name? Forgot. I know Jim Varney plays Cookie. Not Cookie like a snack, but Cookie, the guy. Um, please. Jimmy plays um bed at Alfred Cookie Fonsworth. Gordon Burton as Gaten and Moe. And Leonard as Kesma Knita, who plays the king. 
John Mahoney as Preston, B. Wiltmar, David Older and Steers. Uh, Fenton, Q Hardcore, Flores, Sandy as Wickmana, Bertha, Bertha, Jack Grant Osper as Audrey, Audrey Rico, Ramandis, Claudia Kristen Adley, Lee Haga, Haga, Phil Moore as Dr. Joshua Strong Bear Sweet. Don Navito as Fessy, Vinny, Vinny. Summer plays as Kia, Kia's mother, yeah. And Jane Garner as as Commander Lee Tip, Tiberius, Tiberius, Rookie, yeah. So he, he reunites with these guys, so he goes down on the water. Yeah, to find Atlantis. And what's what what happened? Milo actually gets separated from them. They reunite this woman by the name Nita. Kita, Kita, yeah, Kita. So he so he explains the the language they were speaking. Atlantic, Atlantic, Atlantis language. Yeah. Yeah. This movie is a classic. So yeah, so the guys, so they, they, they the, the, the villager take them to their village, show the king, he has a crystal that heal the power, of eternity. Yeah. Yeah. And then something's going on. Uh, uh Tiberius, took Nita, and she, and he. Kills his father, who was the king of of this of land. Um, yeah, and then, yeah, so Milo stays behind here. The rest of the guy is going to make him take Nita's turn to be a reveal, to reveal, reveal a crystal herself, and everyone, they place in the box, protected a uh, security box. Yeah, and Milo get angry again. They get in a great fight. It leaves there and you get this thing. You can use, they use the Chris to drive like almost like a car, which this thing right here. I'll show you right there. Yeah. So they chase after them, and the guy shoots like fire the guy. So Helga doesn't want to do anything, but she gets dropped by Tiberius. And he's shooting her, shooting him. And Milo got almost there. And Tiberius has the axe. And Milo used the crystal to cut his uh, cut in his forehead, a forearm, to be, able, to be a crystal like the shining. And after he, when he sees the blaze, he cuts him into pieces and he's dead there. Also, Hager stays down there. So they were night. Nice. They bring Nita back to the place, and they use the crystal and sort of all the powers, and they bring it back Atlantis. And Milo stays home, stays here, stays there with Nita. And while well, the father dies, this one. Yeah, I mean the story was all right. It's not better than the other Disney movies. Uh, this one's a classic. My favorite Disney classic has to be The Lion King, The Fox and the Hound, and Cinderella. Also, The Rest of the Words, and also um, The Santa Claus one. Yeah, the classic as well. Yeah. Yeah. I know where there was a sequel in 2003, uh, Atlantis 2, Milo's Return from 2003. I don't have that DVD either. I will find that cheaper place. I don't think Walmart don't have that. I don't Target don't have. I know Drift Store, Red Store do have that one also, which I will find that. I could please. So this is the first one. Michael J. Fox did not come back, or Jim Varney didn't come back in the sequel, but different actors changed their voices. Well, the original cast member comes back in the sequel, which is good. 
Um, kind of the same story with, um, with um, the Secret Life of Pets too, where Max was uh, Louis, Louis, Louis C.K. was replaced by Pat Oswalt. He did perfect job, and this one, the sequel, they did different actors. Yeah, both of your cast comes back. Yeah, same thing, same for story, different new characters, and uh, movie ends right here. Yeah, and then for bonus feature it has all you contour with producer Don Hanna and director Kurt Wise and Gary Tr Trustdale, the lead scene Billy Viking for log prologue. Disney PO, Atlantic fact or fiction and fun and interesting theories about the laws causing a continent of Atlantic visual tours of CG model 3D drones of the UBC submarine and Lamedy. How to speak Atlant Atlantean with the famous linguist who developed the Atlantean, Atlantean language. Vacation, full frame, widescreen, circle effect ratio. It's on for 96 minutes. It's a PG4. For action and violence, yeah. Now I'm going to show you this. That's my movie review on Atlanta, The Lost Empire, the first one. Actually, a classic. This is after, um, this, the second movie they did was Treasure Planet. That was one of the unrated. This is also an unrated, also Brother Bear as well. It's released by um, Disney. Yeah. I believe, yeah, Disney owned this one.